Want to know the secret to the success of the many small businesses in Rancho Cucamonga? Well, it all comes down to the Small Business Development Center housed in the Chamber of Commerce. A dancer her entire life, Coy Dunstan never imagined she could own her own dance studio. Back in 1995, I was actually stretching and getting ready for class and thinking, everybody in my family, my friends, why don't you open a studio? And I'm thinking, I'm a dancer. I don't know how to do this stuff. But thanks to working with the Inland Empire Small Business Development Center, or SBDC, for over 15 years, she has far surpassed her goals. I'm the director and the owner of Inland Valley Dance Academy, which without the SBDC would never have happened. Never have happened. I never, I would have quit easily before I even got five years in without the, out the SBDC on backing me up and, and the, the knowledge and just everything. There's, you name it, from the accounting to just everything you can imagine involved. When it comes to helping small businesses start, grow, or maintain their success, the Small Business Development Center in Rancho Cucamonga is a one-stop shop providing all the tools that any business owner might need. Small Business Development Centers, it's actually a nationwide system. There's about 1,050. Um, it's a system of private nonprofit organizations. Small businesses, there's not a lot of resources out there for them that they know of, okay? Um, and so we hear a lot where people say, oh, I wish I would have known about you guys before when I had this business with my brother-in-law before. Robert Archer has been working with the city for over 13 years, and his specialized know-how and expertise has helped countless businesses succeed beyond many owners' wildest dreams, using workshops, training sessions, and one-on-one -on -one mentoring, to name a few tools. Well, one of the things that the businesses in general always have issues with, and even especially now, it's more important, is the marketing side of it. And so we'll work with them more on marketing now, um, as the social media, you know, that's right around as social media really came big, as things were coming out of the economy. So we've added different social media workshops. Um, next year, or we're just putting our 2014 training calendar together. Next year, we're actually tripling the number of social media workshops we're doing. And Koi isn't the only success story. Newer companies like the popular mobile barbecue station, P-Train, started only a few years ago and has been thriving for now over four years, thanks to Robert's help. When I started talking to Robert about five years ago, I had no idea what, uh, what I was getting into, uh, but he explained the whole the process, the steps of the way. So uh, he explained the difference between sole proprietorship and you know, LLC and being incorporated and those type of things. So he allowed us to kind of make decisions and on structuring the company, which was the most important part. And owners Maribel and Kevin Brown of Minuteman Press turned to the SBDC when they had ambitions to expand their business to a larger location. We were moving from the other location to this one. Um, Hilda Kennedy, who um, was trying to process the loan, she referred us to Robert uh, to do an, a business analysis because uh, not only that we were purchasing the building but also acquiring the press. So he did an extensive research and um, in analysis for our business and uh, everything that he said and everything that he was giving us in the projection uh, were very helpful and he was actually right on. And the best part is the services are completely free for residents. Robert's company has contracts not only with the city of Rancho, but cities throughout the Inland Empire including Chino, Eastvale, Ontario and Upland. And the SBDC continues to expand their services, recently coming out with a mobile app that helps promote businesses associated with the Chamber of Commerce. And like just this week alone, the Chamber rolled out a mobile app it's called Rancho App, right? And it's something where basically what the Chamber's website would be, plus more, is already is just basically on a mobile app. Bringing you the best of Rancho Cucamonga, I'm Conchetta Duluco with Healthy RC Living.